How much do they pay? Uh, right now, it's almost at uh, like 35 bucks. It's like 34 and change, almost 35. And uh, in October, like they'll kind of like basically give us like a race. Did you have your license or did they help you with no, that? No, they helped me get my license, yeah. Like I tell everybody, when you come into this business, don't come in with the mentality like, oh, only my eight hours. You know, you just got to be ready for everything. You All right, so you work for FedEx Freight. You need a special license for this? Uh, you need a Class A. Any endorsements? I have a hazmat uh, for the SIDs, for tankers too. So it's freight. What, what does that mean exactly? What do you do? Pretty much anything that's palletized. Probably like 95% of our stuff is palletized. And it's, uh, most of our stuff is commercial, and we do some residential too. But for the residentials, we have like a pop tail. And do you need experience to start driving for FedEx freight? Uh, well, like with us, usually um, they like to hire within. Mm. You know, so basically you start there, you start in the yard, you know, you start like hustling, moving the yard dog and everything. And then, you know, if a position comes up, you know, and if you're like next in line, they'll, they'll put you through the class and everything. When you started with FedEx, did you have your license or did they help you with no, that? No, they helped me get my license, yeah. I started in the dock and I just worked my way up and they helped me get my license. Okay, so no license, no, no experience no and they experience. help you. Yes. Okay, so how many hours do you get per week? Uh, right now it's like kind of slow, but I mean, it could vary like right now anywhere from 8 to 10 hours right now. Uh, like when it's busy, I'm like going anywhere from 8 to like 14 hours, you know. It just depends. And how much do they pay? Uh, right now, it's almost at uh, like 35 bucks, it's like 34 and change, almost 35. And um, we have like the cost of living, like the review coming up, mm -hmm. uh, but we don't know yet how much are they going to give us. Nice. It's like a cost of living, so in October, like they'll kind of like basically give us like a race, you know, but probably next month we'll kind of know like what we're looking at. Anything else you want to say about the job or anything in general? Uh, well, like I tell everybody, a lot of people want like an eight-hour job, but technically this is like not an eight-hour job, you know? Yeah. Um, like, like I tell you, it could vary. Like when it's really busy, we can go anywhere from eight to 14 hours, you know? Yeah. I'm um, like, but if people are trying to get into this, uh, just don't go with the mentality that, oh, it's just going to be eight hours. I mean, unless you can find a company that's like only eight hours and that's it, you know? Yeah. But like I see like, or I talk to a lot of drivers and a lot of them were like, oh, you know, I'm just trying to work my eight and this and that. But... I mean, if it's slow, yeah, you could probably just work your eight, but like I tell everybody, when you come into this business, don't come in with the mentality like, oh, only my eight hours. You know, you just got to be ready for everything. You get a little bit of everything, like different areas. Like I personally like going to different areas, you know, like that way you don't get bored in the same spot. But there's a lot of drivers that they just rather keep like their area, you know, it just varies. Every, everybody's different, you know. So you go city to city. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I have different routes. I mean, sometimes I'll stay with the same route for, like, a couple of weeks. But, I mean, pretty much they have me moving around, nice. which I like because I, I don't get bored. But, uh, like I said, like, there's other drivers that they just prefer, like, stay in the, like, the regular route, you know? But, it sounds like you would recommend it to other people to start here. Oh, yeah, definitely. I mean, you know, it's not bad. It's not a bad company. You know, it's like anything. There'll be drivers that are like, oh, no, I'll never work for FedEx. There's drivers that will, like, I'll never work for this company, you know? But... I mean, so far it's treating me good. Like I have no problems. And can somebody make like a hundred thousand a year, six figures with this job? Yes. Oh yeah. Easily. Oh yeah. I mean, especially if you go over like to what we call like road. Okay. So those guys get paid a little bit more an hour, uh, but for them it's just straight pay. They don't get overtime. But that's that's why they get like a little bit more money to kind of like compensate. So those guys can work 10, 12, 14 hours, and it's just straight pay for over the road right yes okay so basically it's a nice they're the guys that move the sets or they move the rails what we do from our yard we have a uh, we go to Whittier we go to San Bernardino uh, we go to Mariloma we have a couple of drivers that go to Tucson uh, those guys have to lay over over there you know so they go over there and then they, they uh, lay over and then they come back the next day and then we have a driver that goes to uh, Kettleman but that's a that's a one-way trip so he goes in the same way except the Tucson drivers it's like basically what well, one's going the other one's coming back this guy is good, like if you're trying to get into the, get your class A or something, because he interviews a lot of different uh, companies and everything, and you get to see like a little bit of everything, how like each company works, and so, you know, it's just, that's just from us, FedEx, but i seen like, you know, you do a lot of other different drivers, so, you know, like for somebody that's new, that's trying to get into like this side of the business, you know, with their class A, uh, it's good to like kind of see like the perspective from different companies and how much they pay, what you got to do and everything. Thank you, I appreciate that. Thank you so much. All right, man. Thank you for your time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good luck.